in this week's restaurant report card, there were no closures in our area. But several restaurants started the new year needing to make some changes, and they did it fast. Cleaning up, improving pest control, keeping food at the right temperatures, all things that needed addressing. Red Elephant and Grill on San Jose was cited with three serious violations. They had to throw out several food items because they were more than 10 degrees above a safe temperature. The inspector did come back three days later and managers had done the work. All the temperatures were safe and Red Elephant Pizza Grill was in the clear. A popular Italian restaurant also grabbed our attention, but made some fast fixes. Caraba's Italian Grill needed a follow-up inspection after just two high-priority violations. They did have to stop selling chicken salad, calamari, soup, and some other items because they were too warm. According to the report, they were left in a region cooler all night instead of transferred to a different cooler. And again, three is the lucky number. The inspector came back three days later, and everything was good to go. Zero high-priority violations that could make you sick. And finally, Pompeii coal-fired pizza still needs a recheck after two questionable inspections. During the first, the inspector found what she described as roach excrement, 50 old dried roach droppings, and a broken cooler storing soda bottles in the office. Five days later, the inspector came back and everything looked okay, except they had not documented some renovations they had already done with the state. So because of that, Palm Bay Coal Fire Pizza will need to file that paperwork and get another inspection before it's in the clear. Now coming up tonight at 10, we did talk with the owner about the violations. We were quickly thrown out. She was not happy with our questions, but I was able to coerce her to talk with me off camera about the roach droppings. And she said it was all a mistake. I posed some questions to the state and we'll tell you what they had to say to that. Her explanation coming up at tonight at 10 o'clock.